Hi guys, my name is Justin, guitarist and producer of The Room Color Charleston. I'm Jared, vocalist of The Room Color Charleston. And this is our studio documentary for our new single, Nexus Point. So we've been working on our single Nexus Point for a little while, and we've uh, completed pre-production. And um, a lot of questions I get sometimes is what kind of tools we use as a do-it-yourself band. And uh, I can, I'm going to show you around to some of the stuff I use to uh, produce our own stuff and show you kind of the studio, that, the little studio that we have. So obviously uh, our pre-production is completely done, and for drum tracking we use Superior Drummer. And, uh, that's what we've been using to write and uh, record drums for this single and for our album. So uh, here's a little snippet of some of the drums from the single. As you can see, we've got guitar tracks and uh, lead tracks and clean tracks, and this isn't even finalized. This is just uh, pre-production. So that way we know exactly how the song is going to sound. That way we know how the song is going to sound before we start principal tracking, which we're getting ready to start doing now. So let's, uh, let me show you a little bit of the gear here. I have here a, a Pod X3, which I, I'm using for tracking, but I'm not actually using for the guitar sounds on on the record or on the or on the single. Um, for vocals, I'm actually going to use a Fireface 400, which is an awesome uh, which is an awesome interface. And uh, obviously for tracking, you can see my guitar here is the is a that I'm using is a, for this is just the uh, Schecter Damien Elite seven string. And if you come in here, you can see where we do our vocal track. So in here is the vocal tracking booth I've set up basically in a closet, which in the mic we're using is an Audio Technica 4040 that I run into the uh, RME Fireface 400. And that is basically the gear we use. So that is the gear we use to record our, uh, our album and uh, to produce a single. And uh, I think it's going to sound really good and uh, it's going to be a step up for us. Uh, Hello hey guys, this is Jared from The Room Color Charleston, and right now we're getting ready to uh, record some rhythm tracking and solo tracking for our new single, Nexus One. <laughs> Abortion. What you doing? Move on to that bias. That bias. For all you do-it-yourself fans out there that do your own recording, um, one thing I would say I would advise to really focus on is your bass tracks. Uh, guitar tracks are really important, and everybody's always trying to get the holy grail of guitar tones. But really, you can't have a great sounding track without a great bass tone. Um, so I highly suggest every time you track bass, get brand new strings. And that's what we did for when we tracked bass. I uh, got brand new strings, and we got the Via Dario Pro Steels, which are really bright strings. But uh, I'm just going to show you a clip of our, our bass tone for this uh, for Nexus Point.
So as you can see in the bass tone, it's not really actually that clean. There's actually a, a lot of distortion in the bass, and that actually helps glue your, your guitars and bass and everything together, throwing a little bit of distortion in the mix. Um, but that's bass tone, so that's one of the things uh, we suggest that you do to make your uh, bass tracks sound a lot better. So uh, what's the new song Nexus Point about? Well, it's about recognizing flaws in the society and how to, in a way, you know, change society to some point, recognizing problems that need to face. What are you drinking? I'm drinking some phenomenal coffee that my guitarist fiance made for me. Which is me. Which is you. <laughs> All right. Time has come for a new consciousness. Tell me more.